Welcome back to Pot Dos. If you haven't seen the last one, go ahead and click wherever it may be. I will probably don't even want to put it there, but you know, just go ahead and click part one on my channel. <gasps> okay, so, um, this is, it's always so hard. I got it from the Dollar General. It's LA Colors. It's, like, this isn't the actual color. This is just the shimmer. But you could, like, put it on top of, like, your lipstick and whatnot, and it looks like that. And I probably, like, well, like, it does look like that, but, you know. You know. I don't need to explain it to you. You already know. I have an EOS balm. Everyone knows what EOS is. Ooh. I'm egging my lips. <laughs> okay. And then, I have this lipstick that my sister, um, whenever I say sister, I'm talking about Erica. So, my sister's mom gave me, like, a long time ago, but I still have it. It's down to there. It looks... It's a dark color, and it looks like that. Can you see that? Yeah, you can see that. Okay. And then, this is one of my Milani lipsticks that I bought. It's Uptown Mauve 20. And the color looks like that. It's so pretty. And so pigmented. Like, that's the shade. Like, it's so cute. Um, this is a color workshop lipstick. I don't know, but it's another primer thingy, shimmery thing that looks like that right there. Another Clinique thing. This one, I, it, it, it is so good. It's Tender Heart. And it looks like that. And the color is, is, is a light color. It just looks like that. It's really light. I like it. Now my friend gave me this. But it's almost out. See, this is how we do. Me and my friend, we give each other stuff that we already use. That's just how we do. It's great, but whatever. Anyway, I'm already finished with this anyway, so bye-bye. Um, this is another color workshop that my friend gave me. My friend gives me a lot of shiz. Like, her name starts with an A. And if you do know who I'm talking about, then yeah. Um, the color looks like that. It's a pretty red color. I don't know why she doesn't like like dark pigmented lipsticks. She likes the light ones. I like the dark ones. It, this is another one that she gave me. It's a little pinker from that color. And I'll put it like right there. But that's what it looks like. Still so cute and pretty. And then this is, um, it used to be like advertised, this is a lip gloss that is made to make your teeth look whiter when you put it on. And I like the edges because it's circular, but, and it smells minty. Like if you're here and you could actually pick this up and smell it, it smells minty. And this is the color of what it looks like. It's really dark purplish. I like it. It's a, like, it kind of looks like it would go great with Black Cherry and Milani lipstick. Um, I have another Milani lipstick, speaking of which, it's Flurry Fuchsia 16. That's what it looks like. I'm running out of hand space, but that's the color. And then, 
another lip gloss my friend gave me. She actually bought this for me. It was like a dollar or something. I actually already used all this, I think. Hold on. Yeah, still there, but... Actually, I think it's empty. So I'll toss that. Um, another lip gloss that the same A friend gave me. That's the outside of it. I think I squeezed it too much. Um, it's another one. This is one of my favorite ones. I think she gave this to me. I don't know if I bought it for myself or she gave it. I'm not sure. But I like it. And I use it a lot. I did. And then, I have this lip balm that oh, my friend gave to me. Oh my gosh. I don't know what kind it is. Smells neutral. I bought this for myself. It's a lipstick from LA Colors. And it's chocolate brown. It smells like chocolate too. But that's what it looks like. And that's what it looks like right there. I have this lip gloss. It's like, this would actually go great with the brown LA color lipstick that's right there. Like, wouldn't it? Like, I would think so. Yeah. Then I have this lip gloss that my friend also gave me. It's Lip Luscious Tasty Lip Color Sheer. And it is Frozen Daiquiri. I bet she bought it from, um, What's that place? Uh, Bed Bath and Body Works. Yeah, that place. They have great lipsticks and, I mean, lip glosses. I have these two lip stains from CoverGirl Atlas. I have one in 440 and I have one in 410. The 410 is the more purpler one, and the 440 is the more reddish one. And then, I also have this lip gloss, a duo combo, which would go great with the lip stains, because that's red. And then, this one is purple. That's what it looks like. And I've used them a lot, but... And then... I have these, which are lip glosses, one's shimmery, sparkling, one's pink. I have another brown lip gloss, hydrating lip gloss, exuberant and lub labial, or labial, I don't know. I have another lip gloss by Unforgettable Moments. Looks like that. I have another lip gloss that my friend gave me. I don't really use it, but it's a girl thing. And it came in a pack, but it's kind of dirty up from this bag that of my collection. So I'm probably going to toss it because I don't even use it that much. Like, no offense, girl, I love ya. But, I have this other thingy, lip balm that my friend got me as well. I have this one that my friend got me as well. It's $5.99. When my old lip gloss. I have nothing. I 
have another Milani hot pink. I think this one, yeah, it's uh, it's messed up, but it looks like that. And since it is messed up, I'm going to toss it. I don't know why I didn't do this before. I have another lipstick that my sister's mom gave me. It's 150 Flame. If I can open it. It looks like that. And that's the color. I should start wearing these and be grateful for like all the makeup that I have. I don't have any makeup on, by the way, so. And this is a Wet n Wild lip gloss, speed gloss. I think this is the one that leaked out. I'm not sure. I have one that leaks out. And I'm pretty sure it's this one. So I'm actually going to toss that. And then I have this lip gloss. But yeah. And that's all the lip glosses and lipstick that I own. Actually, there's one more up there, but I don't feel like getting it. And now, eyeshadows. So I'm probably going to go through this fast. I have this palette. I don't know what it's from, but it's browns. Um, I have, I'm going to hide this up because it's ugly. I have this palette that has blush. And I think it's a color workshop palette. And the mirror is gone. There's a mirror up there, but it's gone. And there's the pretty colors. It's not really pigmented a lot. But it's still cute and fine if you're going light. I have this one that my friend gave me. She, okay, I used the first three, but obviously she almost ran all black out, so. It's fine, though. I still love her. It's by Maybelline. Um, I have this that my friend, my sister, bought me for Christmas one time. It's like an iPod thingy. I used, I think it was like freshman year when she got this for me. My freshman year. I got these three and you know these three palettes from LA Colors. This one is Orchid. If you want to like go light. If you want to go bright I got Peony. I love it so much. Everyone thinks it's so pretty on me. And I also love this color. It's called Water Lily. They look good on me too. I have these other things. Kind of like the brown palette, but it's like purplish and yellow. And I have this color, which is from Sally Girl. It's shimmer strips and it looks like, it looks like that. I have this Clinique sort of palette deal. If I can open it. I think this is a blush and then like eyeshadow and like, I don't know. I think that's a highlighter. And then... This, I'm going to cover the lip gloss up because, like I said, they're ugly. I used most of this. This one, my friend um, from the Color Short Workshop, she gave me this when she was, like, doing her modeling thing. And most of, like, the lipstick that she gave me was from her modeling thing, like, the black ones. But, Marquins? Marquins. That's who it's distributed by. And then I have these three CoverGirl ones. I have the green one, which is so pretty. 
I have the pink one. I like to use it for the eyelid or the highlighter. And I have the blue one, which is so pigmented. Like, all of them are so pigmented by CoverGirl. And then I have these uh, sparkle things that would go over your eyeshadows. I believe my girl T got me these three pigmented eyeshadows. One is black, one is dark purple, and one's like really light, shimmery purple. And they're still so pretty. And that's basically it. I have more somewhere. But I'm just going to put this away for now. That's all ow. That's all of that pack. And here's my bag. I go around everywhere with this bag for now because it's yellow and cute and pretty and I love it. I have a few and here's my makeup bag that came out of that bag. And I told you where I got it. And here's more brushes. There's it comes with the um, crease fluffy brush. That I, well, I use it for a crease, but like it's also stuff too. Um, the eyeliner brush, the powder brush, and the blush brush. And it's sparked. And then I have this mascara from LA Colors. It's supposed to curve and strengthen your lashes, and that's what I use. I have this blush that I'm so happy for because it's like my favorite and only blush that I use. And I have this dual eyeliner eyeshadow from LA Colors. One's like grayish, one's black, and then this Avon lip gloss that, guess what, my friend gave me. And it looks like that. And yeah. Oh my god, I actually beat the time that I did it. All good. So, yeah. That's probably the end of tonight's videos. If you want me to keep doing stuff like these, then comment, like, and hit that subscribe button because I do make new videos every day, twice a day. Uh-uh-uh. Uh, <laughs> see you in the next one. Bye-bye.